Hello, and welcome to Moon Pie and Cumhead's Cafe. No, get get the fuck away, kitty. Get the go, go. Sorry about that. My cats have been really pissing me off all day today. They keep knocking my camera over. So uh, yeah, I'm not very happy with them right now. Today, today, I'm gonna teach you guys how to make some five star worthy on Gordon Ramsay's level shit. This could be any time you want to. It's very cheap. You can go to your local Walmart. It's not too fancy because I don't know how to make a lot of stuff. This is this is something I hope to God I can make. I'm not very good at cooking, but uh, I'm an adult now, so I kind of have to learn how to do shit now. There's a bird outside and it's got my attention. I gotta go see the birdie. All right, well, that wasn't no bird. That was, uh, that was the mailman. We're gonna be making some chicken parmesan. Very simple, but these are the ingredients you're gonna need. So first you gotta get yourself some uh, some frozen chicken patties. Mm -hmm. You gotta get a regu, uh, mariana, uh, 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 sauce. Fortunately, you're supposed to use provolone cheese for this, but uh, unfortunately at the moment, I don't think I have provolone cheese, so we're gonna use cheddar. Let's try to make this bitch. First step, how to cook it. It's always the first step, right? We, we, we gotta do that. So for continental oven, preheat the oven to 400 degrees Fahrenheit. I don't know how to use an oven. We're, we're gonna be using this thing that's only been found in a Moon Pie and Cum Heads Cafe. It's called a microwave. You, you, put, you put shit in it. I have no idea if I should put just one. And my dogs are barking for no fucking reason. Then I have to... Use this. Uh, by the way, these are spicy. I'm more of a spicy chicken sandwich guy more than a regular chicken sandwich. So, you know, it's your preferred. So this is this is our bowl. This is what we're gonna use for a bowl and shit. And I, I might want to do this a little closer to the camera so y'all can see this shit. Should I put the sauce on first? Yeah, that's yeah. Let's put some of the sauce in there. Just kind of. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's fucking disgusting. I don't even think that's the right sauce. <laughs> I think this is more like spaghetti sauce than it is like regular sauce, but uh, you know what? We're gonna we're gonna make it fucking work. So that's what it looks like right now. You guys can't see it. Oh shit, it's sliding. In the microwave, it says we're gonna cook for about three to four minutes, or about two to three minutes. So the first two minutes, since it's frozen, we're just gonna leave it like that in the microwave, let it cook, and then put the cheese on it for the last minute. So, well, we're gonna do that. We're gonna do that real quick. As you can see, I don't know if you guys can hear it, but the microwave, it's cooking and it's counting down. So uh, yeah, so you, you'll have a timer so you don't have to use the oven. Oh shit, I forgot to put a lid on it. So, you gotta make sure, okay, when you put stuff like that in the microwave, you gotta make sure you put a lid on it. Because only, only, only this sauce, only this sauce right here, only, Old world style sauce will splatter, splatter all over your microwave and uh, you'll have to go back and clean it later. So make sure you do that. Oh, uh, just look at that. Mmm, mmm, smells delicious. Now we're gonna put the uh, cheddar cheese on this bitch, making this good as fuck. You gotta make sure you gotta put that cheese on. That looks fucking amazing. This is going pretty well so far. I'm actually, I'm actually kind of glad that this is working out. This is not too complicated to cook. Now that you've got the cheese on your uh, chicken sandwich, uh, throw it back in the microwave for another minute. Make sure you cover it. Now, don't be intimidated by the process. It's not something that's very, uh, it's something that's very straightforward, and uh, it's not something that's too hard and making it three times harder than what it needs to be. It's, I mean, it's just like chicken and sauce and cheese and shit. I'm sure you can put three things together and do twice as good as I probably would have, but this is the quick and easiest method probably tastes the best, so I really recommend it. Oh my god, this is gonna turn out to be so fucking garbage. All right, ladies and gentlemen, it is finally, oh my god, if you can see the shit. Holy fuck, oh god, that is hot. I'm gonna, I'm gonna take you over here real quick so you guys can see it. Since you have your uh, product right here, hopefully that uh, your final product is finished. But the last thing that there is needing to do is uh, taste the final product. As you can see, right there, it's cooked 
all the way through meat. That's actually not bad. Actually, I don't think the chicken's cooked all the way. Actually, the chicken's not cooked all the way. Yeah. I hope you enjoy this uh, this first episode of Moon Pie and Come Heads Cafe. Uh, let me know if you guys want to see any more challenges we want to do. I think we're going to be doing a video together sometime soon. Uh, she's actually not here with me right now, so she's probably going to be here sometime this weekend. And we'll probably make one together. I'm not very sure yet. Tell me what to cook next in, uh, in Come Head and Moon Pie's Cafe. Fucking kill me.